70-year-old Macaulay man is dead after a fire ripped through his apartment building on Date Street this morning. Four others were forced from their homes from the flames. KITV4's Jefferson Tyler spoke with residents about that early morning blaze, including one who tried to save his neighbor. All of a sudden, I heard a pop, and next thing you know, there was just smoke pouring out of the side of the bedroom. Ronald Ferguson tried to save his friend from a fire that took over an apartment complex in McCulley, but wearing only underwear and a T-shirt, he couldn't crawl across the hot floor. By the time I turned around, I got a big suck of that black air, and I had to get out. Ferguson said that a three-foot wall of smoke greeted him at face level. Officials say that the fire made its way from the first floor to the second. The scene afterwards shows the upper levels in worse shape than the bottom. Flames went straight up through the wooden floor. The resident of that apartment who died was a man who Ferguson spoke with several times a month. You know, if you ask him for anything, he would do it for you if he could. You know, it was just simple as that. Authorities haven't yet released the victim's name, but Ferguson still wants people to know about his resilience. When he first moved in, he had car trouble, engine blew up, lit on fire. And then I helped him get another car, and his wife of 20 years, she had lost a leg from diabetes. And then the next car gets into an accident, and then all of a sudden the ladies rushed to the hospital. Ferguson and other neighbors tell us that she died last year. You know, he really loved his wife. You know, he loved her a lot. He was with her for 20 years. Through it all, he had support. He would always have friends coming over, bringing him stuff. From neighbors' descriptions, he will be missed. Jefferson Tyler, KITV4, Island News.